Let's work on related equations with sums up to a thousand. What fact is missing from this fact family? So fact families are a group of related numbers that can be used in addition and subtraction. So in this problem, we can see seven plus 22 equals 29, 22 plus seven equals 29, 29 minus seven equals 22, and now we need to find the missing fact. Well, let's use our scratch pad. We can see here that there's one addition, two addition, and only one subtraction. So that helps us to know that we're missing a subtraction fact from here. In subtraction, the total is always the largest number that comes first. So 29 is that number. So 29. And in this problem, we subtracted 7 to get 22. So if we want to find the other fact, we can subtract 22 and get 7. So let's type that in, 29 minus 22 equals 7. Now, what fact is missing from this family? Well, this one, we can look again and see that there's one addition, two addition, so we're missing a subtraction. 29 minus 22 equals 7. Well, remember that our largest number, our total, comes first in that subtraction problem. So 29, and then we can switch these two numbers and still have the correct answer. So 29 minus 7 equals 22. So let's type that in. 29 minus 7 equals 22. See if that's right. Correct. Now let's look here again. We have which fact is missing from this fact family. 16, 6 plus 18 equals 24. 18 plus 6 equals 24. 24 minus 6 equals 18, and we're missing one more. So remember, we have one addition, two addition, one subtraction, so we are missing a subtraction problem. And since 24 is our total or our largest number, that will go here. And then we can switch the other two parts of the equation to have 24 minus 18 equals 6. So let's close that scratch pad. 24 minus 18 equals 6. Next one here. Ooh, it's the order switched up on this one. What fact is missing from this fact family? We're not going to let that confuse us. We have a subtraction, an addition, and a subtraction. Well, if we have two subtraction, that means that we're going to need an addition one to complete this fact family. So if we look here, the total comes at the end of, a, of an addition problem, whereas at the subtraction once it comes at the beginning. So we know our total is going to be the end. And this says 23 plus 3. So instead, we can switch these two and reverse the order and say 3 plus 23 equals 26. 3 plus 23 equals 26. Now, what fact family, what fact is missing from this fact family? Let's see how many we have. We have an addition, an addition, and a subtraction, which leads us to believe that we should have another subtraction. Remember that in a subtraction problem, the total, or the largest number, is going to go first. So we're going to have our 27 at the beginning. And then our other two parts of the subtraction problem can be switched. So instead of saying 27 minus 16, we're going to say 27 minus 11 equals 16. Let's look for that. 27 minus 11 equals 16. Found it, so let's close that scratch pad. Awesome job. Looking at this one, what fact is missing from this fact family? 29 minus 9 equals 20, so there's a subtraction, an addition, and a subtraction. So we already have two subtraction. We need an addition. If you remember, in an addition problem, the total, the largest number, is going to come last. So we're going to put 29 here. And then we can switch the order of the add-ins. So instead of saying 20 plus 9, we can say 9 plus 20. 
close that scratch pad and see if 9 plus 20 equals 29 is somewhere. There it is. Great job. What fact is missing from this fact family? Well, again, let's check. We have one subtraction, two subtraction, which means we're missing an addition here. So we're going to set it up to be addition. In an addition problem, the total, the largest number comes last, so we can fit that in. And then we can switch the add-ins on it. So instead of 16 plus 7, we'll have 7 plus 16. Let's close that scratch pad. 7 plus 16 equals 23. What fact is missing from this fact family? Well, let's open up that scratch pad. We have one subtraction, one addition, two subtractions. So that means we need an addition. Let's set it up. The largest number or our total is 11, which means that we can reverse the order of the add-ins and instead have 11 plus zero equals 11. So let's close that out. 11 plus zero. Great job. What fact is missing from this fact family? Let's use that scratch pad to help us. We have a subtraction, addition, and a subtraction, which means that we need one more addition to close out this fact family. Our total, or our sum, our largest number, comes at the end of the equal sign. And then we can reverse the order of these add-ins. So 9 plus 19 equals 28. I see it right here. So let's close that scratch pad. Awesome job. We're on to our last one. What fact is missing from this fact family? Use that scratch pad. Subtraction, addition, subtraction. So that means again, we need an addition one. So addition, our sum, our largest number is gonna come last. And then we can switch the order of the add-ins. So then we'll have 24 plus 23, or I'm sorry, 4 plus 23 equals 27. Let's see if that's on here. I see it right here, so let's close that scratch pad and click it. Awesome job. I think we've done a great job today.